I'm John Grape. They call me the dishwasher. So Ghetto Gastro, founded by me and my boys. We're a Bronx-based collective using food and other things. Community activism, art, design. As a medium to create conversations and thoughts. I always try to create beauty out of things that might not be so glamorous. The year I was born, 1986, it was in the heart of the crack epidemic. Crack, 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 crack. Crystallized cocaine from experiment to epidemic, destroying lives. When I was a kid, I remember being in the playground. You see the crack vials, like, like in the crevices crack. in the phone. Red tops, green tops, black tops. And even though I was raised by brilliant women, and I've watched my brothers go to jail, placed into this prison industrial system, prison pipe, and all of these systems. I still ventured into the streets to make money selling drugs. I've been coming to Venice for a while, and I was like, all right, it'll be fun to do something in glass. The artisanal, the craftsmen, and the masters in Murano, they're the best in the world. Triple Beam Dream this is a biographical bro. project. When I was bagging up cocaine, I was using beautiful glass plateware that my mother had. I would use a Pyrex vision where I use a Pyrex measuring cup. I use a Pyrex mixing cup, specific type of glass. I was able to take heat and it was good for chemistry. Rodrigo, when he started Nuovo with Enrico, his partner in design, I told him I want to do like a reimagined version of Pyrex. So thinking about how do you transmute some of the things that I might be ashamed about but creating something beautiful from it. These are works of art for sure. Social sculpture is kind of this really ironic juxtaposition, taking destructive narratives and creating constructive things out of them. Yeah, like that's the vibe. The future of Ghetto Gastro is really changing the narrative on who gets to create luxury items, what luxury looks like, and what's the history behind it. So really just disrupting that narrative and letting the empire strike back.